So, are you ready to mingle with the doomed house guests? The contract is waiting. Interesting. Do you like parties? Because you've been invited to one. Of course, you'll be killing all the other guests. Are you ready to attend? Ooh. Splendid. You need to go to the city of Skingrad, to the large house known as Summit Mist Manor. There, you will meet up with five very unlucky guests. In order to receive your bonus, you must kill each guest secretly, one by one. If anyone sees you committing murder, the bonus is forfeit. The guests believe there is a chest of gold hidden in the house, and have agreed to be locked inside until one of them finds it. In fact, the guests believe the key to the manor is inside the chest, and only by satisfying their greed will they be allowed to leave. Poor fools. There is, of course, no chest of gold. The guests will find no key. After you arrive, the doors will be locked behind you, as everyone expects. When all the guests lie dead, you will be free to leave. Now go. See the doorman at Summit Miss Manor. He will explain the rest. Have fun. Wow, I have to kill a lot of people. Each guest, at some point in the past, wronged their mysterious host. Now, he's hired us to exact his revenge. <laughs> okay. I, I've heard some talk. This past year, some family members... Have Oh. Go now, dear family member, and may well, thank you. the night mother wrap you in her cold, loving embrace. <laughs> so, the last guest finally arrives. I'll tell you what I told all the others. You go in, I lock the door. You don't come out until it's over. Now I'll tell you what I didn't tell everyone else. We have the same mother, you and I. And she wants you to have this. It's the key to the house. I guess someone else has already told you the other details. Kill all the guests, then leave, right? Well, you better get in there. Time to mingle. Yeah. I don't mean to gossip, but he is more than a bit strange. However, he's always been tolerated as the town eccentric. <laughs> Undena Oretti grows some good to- Good God. Good God. Go, go, socialize. I will. This should be fun. The sixth guest has finally arrived. Well, it's about time. Do you know how long we've been waiting? It Whoever okay. invited us here must at least know us, don't you think? In any event, we're all stuck here together, so we might as well get acquainted. The rest of us have already traded introductions. I'm Matilda Petit. The others are Nels the Naughty, Neville, Devizi Dran, and Primo Antonius. Now, who might you be? Please, tell us a little bit about yourself. Oh, gosh. Yes, well, anyway... Now that we're all here, I guess we can start looking. I'd wish you good luck, but I wouldn't really mean it. The little dark elf. She seems a nice enough girl. But to be perfectly honest, I've never trusted their kind. Huh. The little dark elf. Interesting. That's right, it's a Breton name. I'll have you know the Petites are one of High Rock. Okay. He's a Nord. Mead sw Okay, so I don't really care about what all they right, are. So here we I guess I'd better start looking. It certainly is a nice house. That gold's not going to find itself. So, Nord, if you find the gold, what will you spend it on? Wait, let me guess. A sleazy whore and a nice new battle axe, am I right? I'm going to open a tavern. Not that I'd welcome your... A tavern. <laughs> oh, I should have known. Leave it to a. 
Let's check in the basement. Anyone down here? Nope. Mead. Nothing else. I'm sure there's nothing in here. I'll take it. Cheese bed. Food? Um. Yeah, I'm not letting people take these weapons here. <laughs> Look at all these weapons just hanging out. Right, Caesar? What's up, baby cakes? Alright, I went over there. Let's take a look up oh, upstairs. Okay, there's three people here. Four people here. I can't quite decide where I should look. I don't want to break anything, but the chest of gold could be hidden anywhere. I can't quite decide where I should look. I don't want to break anything, but the chest of gold could be hidden any- Uh, yeah, you said that already, dude. No. I'm sure there's nothing here. <laughs> Some gold. So, here we all are. It's- Watch out! Huh? <gasps> <laughs> okay. Well, that's one down. Guess I'll just wait for them to kill each other. And then I'll just have to not get killed myself. That's not what I wanted to do. Watch out! Dead. <laughs> oh, come on. Nobody will find your body there. So many people dead. I just don't know who to trust anymore. This house is a death trap. We're being killed off one by one. What are you doing? We need to keep our eyes on each other. So many people dead. There you are. Th okay, all right. I was in the Legion for a great many years, my friend. I saw a lot of great. It made no sense then, it makes no sense now. But don't you worry. I vowed to bring Davizi's killer to justice. Okay. Three people have been killed, and the only ones left are you, me, and a little old lady. One of us is a murderer, and my money's on the old lady. <laughs> Don't okay. let her looks deceive you. 
Oh, damn. Well, then it's just you and me, bub. <laughs> this is a cool sword. Check that out. A legion. Legion boots, Legion everything. Woo! Well done. Not only did you kill the five guests, you acted as an agent of terror and grief. All you right. have earned your reward and bonus, assassin. I lay upon you now the Night Mother's blessing. May she walk with you always and guide your hand as you act in accordance with the five tenets. Um. Greetings once more, assassin. When you're ready, I have a most important contract. One that has been sanctioned by the Black Hand itself. Scartail is a traitor to Argonia and a blight upon Tamriel. Kill him as my brother requests, and we will be forever in your debt. Okay. I'm gonna go do that right now. Go now, dear family member, and may the Night Mother wrap you in her cold, loving I should be sleeping. We ain't. We're here. How are you? I guess I've been expecting you, assassin. Don't try to deny it. I can see it in your eyes. That's because your I'm dark brotherhood through and through. Let me guess. It was Ochiva, right? No, wait. Uh, Tainava. Yes, he put you up to this, didn't he? Ochiva was always too busy to even be bothered. Well, you can kill me if you like. I'm afraid I won't make much of a challenge, though. The Argonian Royal Court already sent an agent to do the job. He failed, of course. His body's around here somewhere, but he got him a pretty good hit. If I don't get some rest, I'm probably dead anyway. So maybe I can appeal to your sense of goodwill, huh? <laughs> you let me live, and I'll tell you where I stashed my treasure. Is it a deal? What? Ha! I expect a... Dashingy house. Oh. Yes. What's the matter? Yeah. Uh, let's change this back to that. Good step. So at least I know he has treasure around here. All right, so I've got two things out of the way. I had to kill the guy. <laughs> I had to. No, no things around that one. Otherwise, I would have had to kill some other guy. Ha! Ah, yes, that is an Argonian heart. Of that, I'm sure. You have slain Scartail. Well done. Please, take these boots as payment for your services. And I get free boots to boot. 
They are called the Boots of Bloody Bounding and carry a powerful enchantment. I'm sure you will find them most useful. Cool. Scartail was once as a brother to me and Ochiva, but his act of treason destroyed any vestige of that relationship. His death was well deserved. There are whispers in the halls of the sanctuary. Some say there is a traitor among us, that the Brotherhood has been compromised. Hmm. It's not me. 